Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, SciTaker. In this video, I'm going to do the CPU drilling test in the iQOO Neo 7 device on the day one after unboxing. And this is my first time doing the CPU drilling test in this iQOO Neo 7 as well, as you can see friends. And iQOO Neo 7 which has got the Dimensity 8200 processor and we'll try to see how is the overall CPU drilling graph gonna be there in this Dimensity 8200 processor. So right now I'll try to use 100 threads. As you can see when these are the settings I am trying to use under threads and 15 minutes of time. So right now I am not using any kind of monster mode. So without using monster mode let's do the CPU totaling test. And in the beginning the temperatures are 26 degrees Celsius in the beginning. And again will be back after uh, 5 minutes and 10 minutes. Then we will try to observe the temperatures and the performance numbers. So right now you can see the performance numbers were about close to 4 lakhs as well. You can see clearly. And we will try to see the same performance numbers after 5 minutes. So will it be maintaining same kind of results or will it decrease? So all those details we'll try to see in this video. And right now the battery percentage is about 70% as you can see. And even we'll try to observe the battery how much it gonna decrease. So just now it dropped out to 69 battery percentage as you can see. So we'll try to see how much battery will drop as well while performing this CPU throttling test. So again we'll be back after 5 minutes of time. So right now as you can see friends the performance numbers and after a time of 6 minutes of time close to 6 minutes and the temperature did increase up to 33 degrees celsius and the battery will drop it uh, to 66 percentage from 69 percentage. So these are the results in the iQOO Neo 7 device with the Dimensity 8200 processor. So we will just get an idea how is the Dimensity 8200 gonna be there regarding the CPU totting graph. So that's the main reason I am uh, making this video and in this test i did not use any monster mode so next time i'll try to use a monster mode and then do the testing so i will be back after some time right now as you can see friends after getting close to 13 minutes of time and the temperature did increase up to 36 degrees celsius and you can see the cpu dotting graph as well slightly kind of dropped as you can see just a little bit but we'll try to see at the end of the cpu dotting test results how will be the order graph gonna be there how much throttling can actually expect in this Dimensity 8200 chipset. So that's what we'll try to observe and I can be back after some time. I can to check the overall temperatures and the scores. So right now as you can see friends, these are the final results regarding the CPU throttling graph and the battery dropped up to 62 percentage from starting from 70 and 69 percentage and you can see the highest scores, average score than, and the minimum scores as well and the high temperatures were about 36 and 37 degrees Celsius and the CPU total up to 79 percentage. So anything close to 80 percentage which is not bad I would say regarding the CPU totaling graph. But this test I did uh, I did not use any monster mode while performing this testing. So maybe next time I'll try to use a monster mode and then I'll try to do the testing again. So meanwhile signing off friends thank you for watching this quick information on the iQOO Neo 7 device regarding the CPU totaling graph. Until then signing off thank you for watching and bye.